experience to be in the Hall of Fame. It's a wonderful experience to, to hear all the nice things said about you. But I'd like to dedicate this to my family. Uh, I've got my son Andy with me now, and he's a coach at Comfortable High School. It makes me awful proud to know that maybe a long way somebody seen something in the Ronnie Coffee that's a little bit special that wants to help other kids and help other people. And I see it in my son, I see it in my wife, I see it in my daughter, I see it in my grandkids. It's special to have friends, and I think friends are probably God's greatest gift. And thank God for all the great friends that I have. And thank God for gave me the, uh, the you know, the, the help to be able to do this and keep on doing it. And I plan on not retiring no time soon, y'all. So mm -hmm. say my farewell, I'm going to stay here for a long time because I enjoy what I do. And I just talked to Nashville, Tennessee today, booking an event for Glenmore Park. And uh, it's a big, big name coming to Glenmore Park. And I'm uh, just talking to Ed about it. And uh, I'm really excited about it. We'll make that announcement later. I'm going to sign the contract. So. It's exciting that the exciting the things that happen in Glenway Park, it just absolutely blows my mind. I could go to Nashville, Tennessee, and stand at the Grand Wildfield, see people perform, they perform at the Glenway Park. Last year, one of my disappointments when me and Frankie met uh, Rhonda Vincent, <laughs> Frankie broke the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I could get my camera to work. But one thing, I'm glad Jerry Clark's here tonight. I've been beating him for about 10 years in photography, so it's been very fun. <laughs> Thank you, Jerry. I love beating you in, in my photography, okay? Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you.